it's been a long time coming, but Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 3 is going to introduce us to one of Marvel's most powerful characters, this being Adam Warlock. We of course found out about the, let's say, unexpected casting of the character when they started production, and now the actor himself opens up a little bit about his future after Guardians 3. There is a lot of mystery surrounding Will Poulter as Adam Warlock, because again, if you go back to the Marvel comics, Adam Warlock is a pretty important character when it comes to the cosmic side of Marvel comics, and in terms of power, yeah, he's high up there with the best of them. Of course, he's been on multiple teams featuring multiple cosmic giant characters to say the least, like Silver Surfer and Nova, so it's easy to see why fans are hoping that the character will stick around and won't just be a one and done for Guardians 3. Well, Will was recently on an interview with The Playlist, and he talked a little bit about the journey that we're going to see the character go on. And without going too much into spoilers, because he doesn't want to spoil anything, he says that he doesn't know what's in store for him after Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 3, but he believes that he's ready to go on a journey with this character. Now, if you read between the lines and it's pretty simple, he's saying, hey, look, Guardians 3, yeah, I'm in it, but let's be real. This is the start of Adam Warlock. They're not just going to do a one and done with this character especially with the way that they talk about the Guardians brand ending the current iteration of the team and carrying on with a new one. So I think it's pretty clear in regards to what he's saying and what they're going to do. And he opened up a little bit about his audition in June of 2021 and how he found out about the role in September and then of course starting the production. And he says that he's really interested to see how the fans are going to respond to this because he believes it's something that maybe they're not expecting out of him. And again, I think that's true because of the strange nature of the casting. He did also tease that there's a lot of great stuff and character moments between various characters and him in the upcoming film. But again, he wouldn't go too far into it. So I think most of our hopes are that the character seems like Adam Warlock from the comics and he's kind of a not exactly like the rest of the Guardians, if that makes sense. Don't get me wrong. I really do enjoy the Guardians, their team dynamic, and their foolishness, and their comedy, but Adam Warlock isn't necessarily that type of character, and I hope that they can kind of make him, you know, a little bit more like the comics, a little more serious and dire in what needs to be done, and then slowly build upon his uh, humanity and humor and the wittiness, and kind of give us a progression of the character and growth. At least that's my hope. I know some people will just hope he stays the same. I know some people will be probably very mad that he's not, you know, dropping one-liners every 10 seconds, but look, we're just going to have to wait and see.